Hey guys, this is Arun from the Digital Deepak team. Today we're going to talk about how to find high commission products using Clickback. You might have a blog or an affiliate niche website and you might be thinking how can I add digital products to my affiliate portfolio, not just physical products. The advantage of selling digital products is that anybody from an, any part of this world can buy that digital product. You need, you need not just be an Amazon USA customer to buy the product and as a result you get commissions. Today I'm going to teach you how to pick a great Clickbank product for any niche you have. I'm going to use an example of exercise and nutrition and the same exercise, the same steps can be followed for your niche, be it web hosting or blogging or gardening or life insurance or finance, whatever be the niche, you can follow the same procedure. I'm going to use this for my niche, which is health and fitness. Before you jump into Clickbank, I highly recommend that you create a Google Doc sheet like the sheet which is right in front of your screen which is you have product name the url in, and the gravity and cost per sale i will explain what gravity is and i will go deep into what cost per sale is so just keep this google doc open create this google doc and keep it open so that as and when you get ideas you just enter them here so let's go to Clickbank right now. So this is Clickbank and as you can see there are multiple products which are being displayed and once you land here just go to affiliate marketplace. This is where affiliates find what all new products they have to promote and on the left side you will see categories. I will go to my category, blog category, which is health and fitness. And in that health and fitness, I will dig deeper into a subcategory, which is uh, exercise and fitness. And here are the list of all products under exercise and fitness, which people are ready to pay a commission for. So Clickbank is basically a marketplace where affiliates list their products and where publishers come to Clickbank to pick which of those products are worth promoting. So in exercise and fitness, here are the affiliates who are willing to pay a commission for each sale that you make. So before we go into what products to pick, I will walk you through a few jargons and few key metrics which you should have an eye for the first one is the language in which the product is you see a flag sign here the flag sign here determines the, the language in which the product is the second one is whether it's one time billing or multiple time billing for instance, if the product is more of a subscription based tutorial or a software, then it would mean that the person who is using that software is rebuilt multiple times. And as a result, you get commission every month till the time the user is subscribed to that product. So Pitch Plus is basically when a person buys a product and uh, he upgrades his product using a plugin or an extra theme purchase, you get a commission even if such a purchase is made. So Pitch Plus is an advantage. You would like to promote products which have a Pitch Plus. Then there is this mobile hop link target URL supported, which means that the product which is being sold here has a mobile friendly URL so it's an advantage and then there is a clock which says dollar one trial so people can actually have a trial for dollar one before giving up the other metric you should keep an eye out for is 
average dollars per sale which is dollar 27.57 so for every sale uh, affiliate is making of this product the amount is dollar 27.57 which is good commission which is somewhere around uh, 1800 to 2000 which is a good commission here it says gravity is 60.08 so gravity is 60.08 for this product gravity is basically what are the likelihood of an affiliate marketer making commission by selling this product how many affiliate marketers currently and clickbank are already making money so gravity is that indicator and it's an important factor because it basically tells if you are selling this product what are the chances of you succeeding the average dollar per sale is a summation metric of everything which you see which is initial dollar per sale average percentage per sale average rebuild total and average percentage rebuild all these metrics come together and show up in a single number which is average dollar per sale and you should only be looking at this metric that is why we have mentioned the same in our excel sheet so we have mentioned product name, URL, gravity and cost per sale. Now since I have a health and fitness blog, I will be finding out the best products which I can use, which people would be willing to buy and I will be making good commissions on. So I will sort results by gravity first. So here is a list of products unlock your hip, hip flexors huge conversion boost which is dollar 12 which is uh, i'm not gonna pick this anabolic running mobile they have a mobile option too which is good dollar 15.98 yes this looks interesting because the gravity is 60 this is in the top three in this category and this is dollar 27.57 which is a good commission rate which is somewhere 1800 to the 2000 rupees so i will copy this Gravity is 60. Cost per sale is 27. If I go down, flat belly detox high converting fat loss offer this also looks like a good product to promote gravity is 45.46 As I scroll, I see this has a gravity of 33.81 and average dollar per sale is 36.82. 36 33.81 is the gravity which is good 36.82 so now that we have three products and its gravity and cost per sale now we have to pick the product 
which your audience will have most affinity towards for that we will go to each of these products so this is the sales page so if you are promoting this product the user will land up on this particular sales page and you have to audit whether the sales page is good whether the quality is good this looks like decent sales page it's a video sales page it might work for your audience check if your audience is living in entire three cities of india then they might not be able to access internet at high speed so depending on whatever is the situation so you have to see how your audience looks at this and feels for instance if your audience is from india they might not exactly relate to what this girl is saying who is clearly from some other country so you have to see how the user feels when he lands on the page we'll go to the next product This is your husband uses one simple trick to improve his health. This is long form sales page. Like Deepak's learn digital marketing dot com or learn blogging dot com. Long form sales content. This is great. Money back guarantee dollar thirty seven. Why now? It's a great sales page, and there is an option for affiliates. Let's see what that is. they are giving away emails which convert so they are making sure you have the tools which will help you succeed subject line body everything is given so it's they are helping you out with emails uh, as compared to the earlier product I I feel this product is going to work for my audience because I am running a blog which is more on fitness having the right diet it's about improving your stamina and health in general so I believe this product will be much more useful than back pain let's check the third product which is VFX body five veggies that kill stomach fat so this is about helping women lose weight naturally so yes this also is a good product for my blog so since my blog is about weight loss health and fitness how to build muscle how to build lean muscle so of the three products i say yes to the second product which we open yes to the third product and no to the first product and also since the second and third products are giving me things like affiliate emails so that i can promote it easily i will pick these products so once you have picked these two products you can start understanding what these two products are about so once you do this exercise you will find out what are the products on clickbank which can make you commissions and which your audience would be willing to buy and once you come up with that product you will be writing a blog post reviewing that product or you will be writing a blog post elucidating the pain point which the product will solve and then 
at the end of that blog post maybe you will sell that product in the form of a link or an email capture you can use this exercise for any niche so use it for your own niche and let me know if you have any questions just type them out in the comment sections below and i will reply to you in the best way possible